I'm excited that we are and pleased that we're in the top six. Uh, I'm re kind of reserving my wholehearted support of advancing uh, our airport or Sanderson Field until we see the results of public comment and environmental studies and traffic studies and all that stuff that has to be done uh, before anything, before any projects can go forward. Uh, having, if we complete all that satisfactorily, I'm in full favor of this thing because it will increase jobs, not only just aviation jobs, but peripheral jobs with uh, in the building trades and in uh, ancillary uh, businesses such as hotels and and uh, retail stores and all that sort of thing will will certainly uh, grow if this project goes through. And I'm and it, because we are a economic development agency, uh, I'm fully in favor of things like that. And the challenges I see is that first of all, the runway is only 5,000 plus feet long. So it'll have to be expanded and quite possibly uh, a second runway will have to be uh, added. But I see, uh, as Wendy said, I see the, the future of this is not as a SeaTac a here at Sanderson Field, but rather a uh, an overflow field for the GA the general aviation uh, assets moving from the site that is picked or, or possibly uh, some expanded uh, freight or commuter airlines coming out of here. I, we don't know yet, but uh, those are some of the challenges. And, and plus, one of the big challenges is we're not next to a large metropolitan area or near a large metropolitan area. And the infrastructure access is not there today. So that's going to have to be looked at. You know, we're 22 miles from I-5, and it's essentially a uh, two-lane highway for a large portion of that uh, to get to uh, Olympia. And so increased freight and, and um, passenger traffic capacity isn't there, and will have to be expanded to do that. So, but I am excited that we're we're in the process. And like Wendy said, it's. It's going to be over 20 years before this happens, before the project happens. I I envision the planning process to be in the 20 year uh, uh, framework and any construction is going to be another 10, 15 years after that. So we're looking at a long term uh, process here. <laughs> 